What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. So, we're gonna check out 10 WWE wrestling couples with the biggest age gap. Well, they say uh, love is not defined by the age. When in certain situations, some people are like, you know what? I could be in my 50s and you can be in your mid 20s. Let's make it happen, baby. So, we're gonna check out some of these huge relationships in wrestling, which with big age gaps. This should be a uh, quite an interesting one appreciate all the love and support you guys have shown on the channel let's get right into this video man well, there has been a fair share of wrestling couples that have a huge age gap the expression of age is just a number is clearly the case when it comes to the pro wrestling world as wrestling mm -hmm. personalities have been prone to date individuals that are either much younger or much older than them with on occasion there being an almost four decade age gap. Mm -hmm. Join us now as WrestleMania looks at 10 wrestling couples with the biggest age gap. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell for daily wrestling videos and follow us on Facebook for exclusive lists. Also check out our new channel, WrestleMania Shorts. Number 10, Sasha Banks and Sarah Ton. Mm. Sasha Banks is without a doubt a private individual and we know very few details relating to her relationship with Sarah Ton, who just so happens to be nine years older than Banks. Oh, Ton is wow. a former independent wrestler and this was how Banks and Tom met. I know a lot of y'all like, it should have been me, hit ass. <laughs> and the two have been inseparable ever since. WWE fans may know Tun for his appearances on Xavier Woods' Up Up Down Down YouTube channel and Tun comes across extremely well whenever he makes appearances of this nature. Banks and Ton would marry in 2016 and wow. what's interesting about their relationship is that Ton works as a costume designer for mm -hmm. WWE, meaning that he's very much embedded into the WWE family. Number 9, CM Punk and AJ Lee. I know, I know, it's okay y'all, just put it in the comments. It should have been me! Go ahead, go ahead! Well, the relationship between CM Punk and AJ Lee is well documented and has been alluded to on WWE programming. Punk and AJ began to date in 2013, shortly after the two had worked together in one of WWE's top storylines. The two would proceed to marry in 2014. Another, it should have been me! <laughs> 14, and this is when WWE infamously decided to fire Punk in a clear act of bitterness. Mm -hmm. Punk has been open in relation to his love and admiration for AJ, and AJ, whenever she's taken part in a media interview, has revealed similar feelings towards former AEW and WWE world champion. In terms of the age gap between the two decorated performers, there is a nine year age gap between okay. them, which is on the lower side when it comes to age differences in this list. Number eight, Paige and Ronnie Radke. The prior relationship that AEW star Soraya, AKA Paige had with Alberto Del Rio very oh. much played out in the public eye. This was a toxic relationship and it was clear that Paige was put through a very difficult time during this period. Paige would move on from Del Rio and she began to date Ronnie Radke in 2018. There's almost a decade age gap between the two and fans have been openly critical of Radke's actions on social media. Mm. He's tweeted and shared some insanely controversial content over the past few years and Paige has received criticism for failing to call her boyfriend out for this. Mm. In fact, some fans believe that Paige is an enabler by not condemning Radke's viewpoints, but when this is raised to Paige, she gets rather defensive, particularly on social media platforms such as Twitter. Number seven, mm, Brock Lesnar and Sable. The now, relationship this I did between know about. Brock Lesnar and Sable began to form in 2003 when the two had worked together in a storyline on SmackDown. The two eventually married in 2006 and Lesnar and Sable have a very private relationship mm -hmm. and this is the theme that runs through all of Lesnar's life as he likes to keep as much information away from the public eye as humanly possible. Yeah, he's very private. There's a 10 year gap between the two but this hasn't stopped the two connecting on a deeper level. In a rare 2008 interview with Rochelle Lear, Lesnar and Sable would discuss their relationship and this is what they had to say. I just don't put myself out there to the fans and prostitute my private life to everybody. We just want to simplify some things and we're sharing a cell phone. I'm not exactly without a cell phone, we've decided that we no longer need to have the internet. It's a huge waste of time for us. We spend way too much time on it doing unnecessary things. And what we've actually done with our life now is to try and simplify it a bit. It makes it a lot easier. Number six, Matt and Rebby Hardy. This is the thing about uh about um Brock. He's very, very, very private. He doesn't really say too much. He's not really in the public eye unless he's out there on uh, WWE television or wherever he's at. He's he's pretty low key. 
very low key. And I can respect it, man, because a lot of times this social media world it can it can it can just be draining. You know what I'm saying? People having all sorts of opinions about your relationship and how things should be going. So I can respect it. Just him, just being low key with his with his wife, man. Rebby Hardy is one of the most vocal wrestling personalities of the modern day. Rebby can usually be found letting a voice be heard on Twitter and not all her opinions go down well with the fan base. Ruby met her husband Matt Hardy in 2011 and the two proceeded to marry in 2013. There is a 12 year gap between the two and Hardy likes to credit Rebby for helping him get his life in order. Mm. Hardy would discuss the impact Rebby had on him during his appearance on Lillian Garcia's podcast. Interacted at work. Then when I was going through my darkest days, like, you know, she was the one where other people probably wouldn't have. Like, she 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 doesn't care about anyone, <laughs> like any wrestler or any level of fame. Like, none of that makes a difference to her at all. Like, she, she really doesn't care. She could care. She could care less. Mm -hmm. You know, like, everybody to her is just like a person. And then, like, whenever I was going through my darkest days, like, she stayed on my ass all the time about stuff. And, like, for that, I will always love her. And I'll always appreciate it. And I said, Dad, I'll always adore because, like, not a lot of people would. You know, some right. people either get frustrated and leave, but she was, like, there. That's awesome, man. Number five, The Rock and Lauren Hashian. Due to The Rock being one of the biggest names on the planet, of it's course. hard for him to remain private. This means that there's a ton of information surrounding his life constantly in the media. The Rock is currently married to Lauren Hashian, and the two would meet in 2006 when shooting the movie The Game Plan, and the two would proceed to date for 13 years before tying the knot in Hawaii. Damn. There's a 13-year age gap between the two, which seems like a lot, but The Rock speaks about her with immense pride, and it's only fitting that one of the kindest people in Hollywood finds true happiness. Wow, I didn't Number know that. Number four, awesome. The Undertaker and Michelle McCool. This, I think when a lot Michelle of McCool is began to date The Undertaker sometime in the late 2000s, she received major heat backstage. Dating one of the biggest names in WWE history was going to rub certain people the wrong way and McCool claims that certain talent believed that she was only on WWE television due to her relationship. Oh wow. This was complete nonsense as McCool was already established as being one of the best female talents in the company and her relationship with the dead man did little to influence her strong Sounds presentation like jealousy on to be. television. There's a 15 year gap between the two former WWE stars and the two would cement their love years. when they married in 2010. Their relationship was never addressed on air on WWE television, and this all changed at WrestleMania 33. This was when the dead man broke character to kiss uh -huh. McCool at the end of his match with Roman Reigns. Number three, Kurt Angle. That's when we thought he was all retiring. I mean, he broke character. He rarely does that on screen to break characters. So I'm like, oh, he's retiring. He's kissing his, his wife. Oh, this is, this is it. Angle and Giovanni Iannotti. A WWE Hall of Famer Kurt Angle has found true happiness with his wife Giovanna. There's a 19 year age gap between the two Woo! and the two met on the set of the movie The End Game. They were tied the knot in the summer of 2012 and the couple have had several children together. Angle has found inner peace since meeting his wife and it's great to see one of the greatest in-ring awesome, talents man. of all time find the love of his life. I Number love two, Bret Hart and Stephanie Washington. And what's crazy about the relationship between Bright Hart and Stephanie Washington was that she wasn't even born when Hart began to wrestle. It's fucking wild. <laughs> Brett got the juice! <laughs> Brett got the juice, man! The best there is, the best there ever was, <laughs> the best there ever will be. Brett motherfucking hit man Hart. There is a whopping 26 year age gap between the Woo! two and when the relationship was initially announced, fans on social media questioned the age gap. Nevertheless, Hart and Washington have been married for over a decade and Hart seems to have settled down and found the one he will spend the rest of his life with. I love to see it. My man. My man. <laughs> and number one, Jerry the King Lula uh, and Lauren McBride. Now, I did recently hear, uh, I saw that uh, Jerry was uh, rushed to the hospital. I believe it was a cardiac event. So I'm not sure how he's doing. Someone update me. Let me know how he's doing. Hope Wishing him a speedy recovery. Uh, I know he's had a history of a cardiac event. So it, anything related to that, you definitely got to take seriously. So sending prayers and wishes, uh, get well wishes to Jerry the King Lawler. A WWE legend Jerry the King Lawler has been married several times throughout his life, perhaps his most infamous wife being former WWE star The Cat. 
As things stand, Laura is currently dating a woman named Lauren McBride, who is almost four decades younger than Lola. Ooh. The romance between the two has been heavily criticized by fans as our four decade age gap is rather substantial. The two have also been involved in run-ins with the law as the two were arrested back in 2016 for a domestic abuse charge and Lola was even suspended by WWE. Damn. These charges were eventually dropped which subsequently allowed Lola to return to his specified WWE role. But they have it Damn, first man. in wrestling. Yeesh. I'm once again, still wishing him a speedy recovery. But hey man, the one person that shocked me on this list is my boy Brett. Yeah, okay, I see you, Brett. <laughs> nah, this is dope, man. It, this is just a testament that as long as they're well, let me let me <laughs> word this correctly. Of course, obviously they need to be of legal age. I'm gonna put that out there. But at the end of the day, when it's all said and done, if you have a connection with someone, do your thing. Unless it's just outrageous, like you should. I mean, if you're like fucking 40, you shouldn't be talking to someone that's 21. But granted, who am I to say how you feel about somebody? You know, I, that's the one thing about this video that I, I, I can appreciate is the fact that people don't care. You know, if there's like a 20, 30 year age gap, damn near 40 year age gap, you guys rocking with each other genuinely, who am I to tell you you can't be with them? You know what I'm saying? Like I said, you need to be a, of consenting age, 21 and up. You know what I'm saying? And even 21 is still kind of a, whoa, they're, you know, they're just becoming a young adult. But even then, if that person is okay with it, you're okay with it, who am I to tell you, you can't be with that person, you know, and can't build something with that person. So comment down below. Let me know. What's the widest age gap you've ever dated someone? Like you were dating someone and you have, they were either older than you or younger than you. What was the, the age gap difference? Like the, the biggest one you've ever um, interacted with. But uh, I appreciate all the love and support you guys have shown on the channel. Roll to 150K. And I am still your undisputed YouTube wrestling champ of the world. Appreciate y'all kicking with me. See y'all next one. Peace.